going to Canada. Woo! Road trip to Canada. Canada, baby! Canada. <laughs> I'm excited to see how this is gonna go. Let's go, guys. Hey guys, um, so it got crazy busy last night. When we get home, it was way too late and I just could not do any vlog. But I wanted to tell you guys that the ride from Chicago to Toronto was not bad at all. The kids were very, very good. I just packed a lot of snacks. I'll talk to you guys more about things that you need. Um, but I know it was really helpful to have those snacks in the car and toys. So they were okay. Jubril got car sick or motion sickness, whatever you call it. Uh, one time it vomited, you know, threw up all in the old car. But other than that, everything went well. And okay. now we are in downtown Toronto, about to start touring the city. It's a beautiful city. And I'll take you guys along with me. See y'all later. And it's also halal so we're just gonna get that there's a bunch of them actually you see a lot of food trucks um yeah Hi guys, it's our day three in Canada and we are in Niagara Falls today. It seems like I cannot find a good time for this video to give you guys an update. But it is what it is. We're having too much fun and I just forget to vlog a lot. And if the camera is shaking right now, that's because I'm walking. We actually just got to the water. If you can look behind me, that's Niagara Falls. I'm gonna give you guys a better view once we get closer and get to the um, the observation deck. So, so far so good in Canada. I'll keep you guys updated, bye.
okay it's kind of expensive but i think it's kind of worth it like they have a bunch of different steaks shrimp seafood anything really that you can have um so you know i'm gonna show you guys some clips from there they have live band and they have some dancers and they'll come to your table and dance for you and stuff um so it was worth it it's expensive but it's worth it for Niagara it's been fun the fall guys I could sit in front of that thing all day guys it's day four in Canada we're back in Toronto so I got cut off yesterday I was telling you guys about the all-you-can-eat steakhouse Brazilian steakhouse that we went to yesterday um, it was a very nice restaurant the feel the vibe everything about it you know they have live music they have dancers over there they bring a bunch of different steaks to your table and you get to pick which one you want they have chicken grilled pineapple oh my god they have everything like seriously if you guys ever go to Niagara definitely stop by Braza Brazilian restaurant or Brazilian steakhouse one of the two but the name is Braza it was a very nice place and definitely check it out so uh, once we got back to Toronto last night Jamil got a little sick so because of that it's very late already today we couldn't go out early because we wanted to make sure it was okay so now we are heading out for some brunch and we'll see what happens today I'll So they have some Cajun okay. chili chicken, uh -uh. Cajun chicken fried rice, some poutine, and some pancakes. This is Chinatown. We're going to Kashintin Market from here.
Unfortunately, we cannot do the Skypod tonight because we didn't book our ticket in advance. So yeah, FYI, if you want to come here, make sure you book your ticket in advance. There's like a hundred people literally on the line, even though it's almost, uh, well, it's 926 right now. So make sure you book your ticket well in advance. It's the same thing for the aquarium. We cannot do that as well, but you know. On the track, 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 track. It looks like someone is trying to propose, so we decided to wait here and just see. I don't know, we want to witness it. Why not? 